everybody, I'm Simon, and uh, I just got this package in the mail, and yeah, I'm just going to quickly open it. Ugh. Some air stuff, and there's some things of RAM, which is good. So I just got my new RAM for my MacBook here, and yeah, so I'm just going to... Uh, what are in these? I'm just going to open these up. What the heck? Why is that chocolate? I know you shouldn't eat things out of the mail, but... Alright, so for this installing thing... All you'll need is uh, one of them to take out all the screws on the bottom. And yeah, so I'll just do them. Note that I think it's these three here are longer than the rest. So just remember that. And yeah, so yeah, let's do that. All right, so now I've got all the screws out. Just be careful if you do it to uh, not strip the screws. So just be extremely careful of that because they're kind of hard to replace. And yeah, just suck if you did that. <coughs> I just kept mine in a little robe back here out of camera in order of the way that I did it so I remember and yeah so now we just want to take off this top part and there's the inside of a MacBook Pro you might have seen these if you watched my video on uh, I replaced this hard drive so yeah that's a while back but yeah so I'll just put that back case over to the side here <coughs> and yeah this is the internals of the MacBook you got this super drive, hard drive, battery just the motherboard with all the all the good stuff there's the RAM here, right there, if you can see that. And um, yeah, so what you want to do first before you touch anything is just uh, get rid of all your static electricity by just touching the metal of the hard drive. And then you see these little, there's these little clips on either side, and what you just want to do is just pry them open. And then they'll, the ma the RAM shall just pop up. So we just want to grab that ma RAM. And there's our stick of RAM. I'm probably not going to use this stick, but yeah. Then we just want to do the same with this bottom one. And then you just want to pry it out. Well, this one's being hard to get out. Cause it's on the lower angle, but we should be able to get it out. Alright, I finally got that ram out. That was extremely hard. Um, it was just on the lower level, so it was harder to get out. But yeah, so I've got it out now. Stick that to the side. Alright, so I just got the ram out now. So I just stick them in. You just gotta line it up, because they are, if you'll see right there, they are. They've got that little na latch in them. So you just gotta line that up right. And I'll just do that. And you just want to pop them in on that angle. Push it in. And pop it down. You just want to press it down. And we're all good. Now all you have to do is put the bottom back on it. Get rid of a bit of dust if there's any on that top part. And turn on the computer and see if it's working. So I'll do that now. Alright, so I'm just turning on my uh, MacBook now. It seems to be turning on alright. And... Uh, with this RAM upgrade, it will actually increase the video memory from 384 megabytes to 512 megabytes because it's shared with the main RAM. So yeah, it's all work. It turns on. Let's just see if both of those things are working. I'll just go to sis. I'll just go to about this Mac. All right, so tragedy is struck, and it's only recognizing one of the sticks. I think it's because one of them is a bit hard. To get in so I'll just have to <laughs> retake out all the screws and try again all right so I'll just have to do the same process again I'll just take off this top piece place it over there touch the metal get rid of static electricity and then one of these ram sticks isn't in properly I think so I'll just take them both out oh uh, yeah it was the bottom one I just kind of re pushed I just pushed it in and it worked and it just made a big click so yeah I'll just push that down again and push the top one back on and hopefully it will work now alright so it's just turning on now I hope that it will recognize it and I don't have to go and investigate more and we'll just go to about this Mac and now it's recognizing the 8 gig I'll just show you so yeah there we go that's the video of uh, installing RAM into your MacBook and yeah uh, there's a slight problem with the RAM you gotta really push it in make it click and yeah Hope you guys enjoyed this video and it helped you out. If you uh, yeah, if if it helped you out, why don't you help me out by clicking that little subscribe button up top? And yeah, so goodbye.